my Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So it seems lately that uh, Google is giving Google Chat quite a bit of attention because after posting a day or so ago that Google Chat now has polls and that video will be linked down below and in the end screen. Google has rolled out overnight in my region two more new improvements for Google Chat. Now the first is they say they are introducing a new board tab in Google Chat and basically what this is all about is this feature which can be thought of as a virtual bulletin board they say organizes important information that's just one example of what it can do you can pin and share crucial messages files and links for quick access they say that it helps you stay focused and reduces context switching and it's one location to find relevant information and resources used on a regular basis. That's just a, they give many more examples. That's just four examples for the purpose of this video. And so that's the first of two new improvements. That's introducing the board tab in Google Chat. Now the next is you are now able to create names for group direct messages in chat with Google saying that spaces in Google Chat are meant to focus a conversation around a topic, project, or shared interest with multiple people. But the problem they say is that they know there are times when users prefer to message a group instead of a space in order to manage discussions more easily and find conversations quicker. Users, they say, can now create names for existing and new group direct messages. So there we go. That's just an example of what that is all about. And the rollout pace for both of these new features started yesterday on the 13th of February. So if you haven't seen it yet, um, I would say that by the middle of March, that would have rolled out to everyone using Google Chat. And the good news is, is that... This is available for personal Google account users like myself. And over and above that, it's also available to all Google Workspace customers and Workspace individual subscribers as well. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.